So we're getting a first look at some of the restaurants moving into the revamped water park at National Landing in Crystal City. Isn't that nice, y'all? Tonight, our Matthew Torres explains how this will transform how people eat and play in Arlington. So we're going to make our duck fat fried chicken sandwich. For small space in this shared kitchen in Arlington, Rock Harper knows how to make his chicken sandwiches big and bold. We treat our chicken well, we treat our food well. But the chef and owner of Queen Mother's is ready to make bigger moves by building a new nest right here. At the water park on Crystal Drive in National Landing, developer JBG Smith is bringing in 11 new small and local restaurants as part of its new outdoor food destination on this 1.6 acre park, providing not only the kiosk space, but equipment as well. I'm a native Alexandrian, so this is really exciting to see that area grow and be a part of it, especially with how they're building the community, giving access to entrepreneurs that otherwise would have such a high barrier. And this construction is only adding on to Arlington's already transforming landscape. Just down the street is Amazon HQ2's first phase called Met Park, which is set to open this summer. JBG Smith is also involved with the Tech Giants project. As the area booms, Senior VP of Retail Leasing Amy Rice says providing local entrepreneurs a platform is a priority that can lead to more growth. Small local businesses are the heart of a great community, and that's what builds great neighborhoods. The water park not only will have the restaurants, but also include a stage for live entertainment and the so-called water bar on top of a revamped fountain. Call it 20-plus foot water wall. Um, that comes into a fountain. We took a lot of what was there and just improved upon it. I am a Virginia guy for sure. It's a chance for Harper to grow his roots with the target goal of opening the water park in September. Opportunity like this never tasted so good. I'm really excited to be in community and company with other entrepreneurs such as myself. In Arlington, Matthew Torres, WUSA 9.